Okay, so now, how do we handle this one? So now, we look at these, and again, we see if we can factor them, but these are already factored. So, the least common divisor is going to be both of these, right? Because this is the only factor we have here, and this is the only factor. So, the lowest common denominator is going to be that. So now, if this is the lowest common denominator, then what do we need to do to the top and the bottom? What do we need to multiply by on the top and the bottom in order to get the common denominator? Well, here we're missing x plus 1. So we're going to multiply the top and the bottom by x plus 1. So we're going to get a times x plus 1 over, oops, x minus 1 times x plus 1, and then plus, we have what? Here we're missing the x minus 1. So we're going to multiply the top and the bottom by x minus 1. So we get a times x minus 1 over x plus 1 times x minus 1. Okay. So now we have a common denominator, and so we can add across the top. So what do we get? We get a times x plus 1 plus a times x minus 1, and we get x minus 1 times x plus 1. Okay, so now, now let's see if we can simplify this thing, right? So now we can factor out an a, right? So I can factor out, a, I've got a common factor here and a common factor here. So I can factor out the a and write this as a times this plus this. So this is going to be x plus 1 plus x minus 1. And again, we can just drop the parentheses because it's addition. And we just get this over x minus 1 times x plus 1. And so now if I simplify the top, well, this cancels with this, so plus 1 minus 1 equals 0, and I get x plus x, which is 2x. So I get, actually, 2ax over, well, this here is what we, the form of a difference of two squares, right? But I'm going to leave it like this because we want to leave it in factored form. So it's going to be x minus 1 times x plus 1. So it's in completely factored form. Okay. But if you notice the difference of two squares, you could write it as x squared minus 1 squared, or x, x squared minus 1. Okay. And that's it. See you next time.